hope you're having a great day. Today I want to teach you a one minute exercise. This is a very simple technique that can move you from anxiety to calmness immediately. It's not going to take away the problems that you have or the problems that create your anxiety. It's going to basically help you to reduce your cortisol and your adrenaline. You know, in life, we are going to get stressed. Okay, you can't have a life without stress. It's impossible. And the people who show you that life are suppressing it all in. It's part of life. It's part of nature. We will get stressed, but how quickly we come back to relaxation is where prevention, recovery, feeling good, feeling grateful, all of that exists. How fast we can move to the parasympathetic nervous system. So getting stressed is not a problem. Staying chronically stressed is a problem. This exercise is very simple. I think we did a, this video somewhere during the pandemic and we had tons of testimonials flown from around the world. Of course, I've not learned this on my own. This is not my own exercise. We've learned this over and over again from people who teach neuroscience and everything else. It's for you to do. The beauty of this, there's a warning, there's a side effect, but a pleasant side effect. You may not want to open your eyes for a long time once you're done with this particular exercise, which also makes it a great exercise for you to do before you go to sleep especially if you feel there's too much of chatter in your mind and you're unable to fall asleep deeply. This is fantastic. All you need to do is try it. it works for you. Keep doing it every single day. All right. The exercise is very simple. The simple science around the exercise is on stimulating vagal tone and the parasympathetic nervous system, dropping cortisol and adrenaline, even blood pressure, not in the unhealthy way. And that's why you feel calm. All right. All you need to do, you can sit, back straight. You can take the support of a chair or you can just sit with your back straight. Now what you want to do, okay, is take your right hand, okay, and put it towards the left part of your head. Now I don't want you to pull your head down. I just want you to use your hand to guide it to a tilt. You're not going to pull it down. All right. So if someone has a neck problem, don't worry about it. You're just using it to tilt your head down. That's it. You're not pushing. Now in this position, if you can look my left eye, the opposite, the left eye, I'm going to squint and look up in the corner. All right. I'm going to look up in the corner and hold this for about 30 seconds, preferably trying not to blink. If you blink, it's okay. Just continue 30 seconds. All right. And then what I'm going to do is come back, take a deep breath, take my right hand to the left part of my head, and I'm going to tilt it again, not pull it, not push it, just tilt it, use it as a guide to tilt it and with the corner of my right eye, I'm going to squint and look upwards. You're going to feel a little heaviness in the eye muscles that but that's because you're using the eye in this particular angle. Try not to blink 30 seconds, do a mental count in your head. And then all you do is come back, center, close your eyes and just breathe. Just breathe. You're going to feel a heavy calmness in your head. Some of you may feel disoriented. If you feel too disoriented because you have a very low blood pressure, just don't do it. It's as simple as that. You're not, you're not going to get a heart attack. Don't worry about that. You are in deep relaxation. A lot of people who practice this said that, hey, Luke, we could never meditate in our life. But by doing this, after the exercise, closing our eyes, we could easily move into a very, very deep meditation. Why? Because you're relaxed. It's not possible for you to meditate when you're in the sympathetic nervous system. It's easier for you to go into a deeper meditation when you're in a parasympathetic nervous system. So it's that simple. All you need to do is that. So do it right now. Okay, let's do it together. Hold for 30 seconds each side and then just close your eyes. And I just want you to experience that feeling of calm. It's beautiful. Like I said, the warning is a lot of us may not want to open our eyes. We may just want to be in that deep, deep calm. So then plan the time that you want to do it. Once I tried doing it before a meeting and I just didn't want to go for the meeting after that because I was so calm and so peaceful. So back straight, everyone. Let's do it together. Back straight, right hand, left part of your head. Tilt slowly, don't pull, squint. Yeah, okay. Now with the top of my right eye, I'm squinting and I'm trying to look I'm squinting my eye and I'm looking towards the top of the ceiling or any spot that you feel. And we're doing a mental count for 30 seconds. If you blink, it's okay. Don't pull your head down. Don't strain your neck. Just keep squinting up. You feel heaviness in your eyes. The 20 seconds down, 10 to go. 
Just breathe normally. Three, two, one. Slowly bring your head back down. You'll feel a little heaviness in your head already. Right hand, left part of your head, tip it down. Squint your left eye up towards the ceiling. Conomos point. No need to strain, be gentle with yourself. 30 seconds count. Try not to blink, if you blink it's okay. You wanna feel that heaviness in your eye muscle because you're looking at an odd angle. Be mindful not to pull your head down. 20 seconds, 10 to go. Five, three, two, one. Bring your head back, palms in your lap, close your eyes. And just breathe normally. Don't talk. Just breathe normally through your nostrils, inhale and exhale. You feel a kind of beautiful heaviness and calm in your head. I just want you to be with that feeling. That's it. <clears throat> just be with that feeling. Thoughts are allowed to come and go. Just be with that feeling and breathe. The more you breathe, okay, the more you focus on your breath, the deeper you're going to get into this calm. And like I said, when you open your eyes, you're actually gonna to wanna to close it back again because that's how calm you are right now. It's okay if thoughts come and go. Keep your eyes closed while I sign off. Have a great day, everyone. Until next time, eat smart, move more, sleep right, breathe deep, and remember, you care is all about you. You can do this before sleep. You can do this when you find yourself anxious, when you're stressed out, when you wanna just create deep relaxation in your body. That's how you do it.